hello everyone welcome to another question and answer session here this is the question the following statement relating to the musculocutaneous nerve are true except that means regarding musculocutaneous nerve which statement is false so here this is the options it arises from the lateral cord of the brachial plexus it provides cutaneous innervation to the lateral side of the forearm if damaged the extension of the elbow joint will be impaired it supplies the biceps muscle and it runs beneath the biceps so we have to find out one of the option which will be answer or which is not the function of musculocutaneous nerve so here this is the first picture in this picture we can see this is the lateral cord medial uh, posterior cord and medial cord and this is the brachial plexus and from the lateral cord we can see the nerve arising one is musculocutaneous nerve another one is the lateral pectoral nerve so the musculocutaneous nerve it arises from the lateral cord of the brachial plexus and in the second picture uh, you can see here in the smaller one here this is the cutaneous sensation of the musculocutaneous nerve that means the musculocutaneous nerve it supplies its cutaneous innervation to the lateral aspect of the plexure aspect of the forearm and there we can see this is the musculocutaneous nerve here it arises from the lateral cord of the brachial plexus then it pierces the curaco brachialis muscle then it runs below the biceps brachii and in front of the or over the coracobrachialis and brachialis muscle so after arising it pierces first of all coracobrachialis and then it runs beneath the biceps brachii muscle and this musculocutaneous nerve it supplies three important muscles one is the biceps brachii another one is the brachialis and c for coraco brachialis so the musculocutaneous nerve it supplies bbc muscles b for biceps brachii b for brachialis and c for coraco brachialis then in this picture we can see this is the triceps muscle and this triceps muscle it originated from three region long head lateral head and medial head then it inserted in the tuberosity and it causes extension of the elbow joint so now our answer is now ready that the extension of the elbow joint will be impaired it is not true because the extension of the elbow joint is done by the triceps muscle and the triceps muscle receives a nerve supply from the radial nerve and other options such as the lateral it arises lateral core of the brachial plexus it is true it provides cutaneous innervation in the lateral aspect of the forearm it is also true it supplies the biceps muscle muscle it is true and it runs beneath the biceps it is also true so in case of muscular cutaneous nerve only the false answer is here that the extension of the elbow joint because it is done by the triceps muscle which is innervated by the radial nerve thank you all